I'm just gonna do it all on my own because I'm Hannah and I'm gonna show the world that I don't need anybody and that's real strength. That is such a lie. I felt like I had to prove I could do it all on my own. I remember being in my room and just waiting for someone to automatically know my suitcase was ready to be taken down those stairs. Me, being me, did not dare ask for help. They should have known I needed help. They should have offered automatically. Since no man could read my mind or had any sort of Hannah needs help senses, I got angry. Naturally, I angrily dragged my 50 plus pound suitcase down the three flights of stairs because my pride was on the line. Don't they know that I needed help? I didn't want to seem weak or vulnerable by asking for help. I didn't want to have to put in any effort to communicate that to a man. Don't they just know? No. I'm all for women being fierce and strong and independent. But asking somebody for help does not take away from that. That does not make me weak. One of the things I remember about dragging that suitcase down the stairs, trying not to break my legs and tumble first of all, was that no one was offended by my independence. My decision was embraced and I felt strangely honored as I so clumsily brought my things down the stairs. All the guys who saw me struggling offered the help, which is what I originally wanted in the first place, but I resisted. There must be a way for women to keep their fire, strength, and independence without becoming resentful towards anyone who tries to help. I don't know why we feel like we have to prove ourselves to people. Like, I need to prove to myself and to people I can do this on my own. What is so wrong with needing somebody? There's a difference between being needy, feeling like, oh, I can't do this, I can't do this, I'm a girl, like whatever. No, you can. There's a difference between that and giving someone the opportunity to love you in the way. Giving, being vulnerable enough to say, I want you here. We're asking them and inviting them to love us. We feel honored when somebody asks us for help. Too many times we like to think, we're a burden, I'm too much. Why ask this person for help? Why share my feelings with this person? Why ask them to carry down the suitcase down the stairs? We're not weak when we need help. We just recognize we're human. And I don't know why we have, and I don't know why, I, I too, I have this complex. Like, I'm just gonna do it all on my own because I'm Hannah and I'm gonna show the world that I don't need anybody and that's real strength. That is such a lie. Real strength, real leadership says, I am not afraid to need people. Like, I can open the car door. I can. I'm capable of it. I have hands, I know how to do it. But having a man do that for me honors him and honors me and what, that doesn't take away anything from me. Allow me to speak to that place in every woman's heart that desires for a man, whether that be a brother, a friend, a father, or a significant other to rise up and serve her. That desire is good. Are we doing our part though and giving men the freedom to serve us? Or are we dragging a suitcase down the stairs in order to prove a point? Only a strong woman who is confident in who she is can allow a man to serve her and honor her in the ways that men and women are made for.